Hello and welcome back to Orsted. In our last episode, I thought we were done, but we're not. There's a couple of things we can do uh, yet. Uh, some that I talked about in the last episode and some that I learned about as part of talking with Kex and some of the folks in uh, his Discord, as well as some of you in chat and comments and things like that. Uh, there's that. There's that geode, and it gave us a spark of inspiration. Good. Um, so we're just gonna do a little bit of uh, a little bit of change today, and do a couple things that we, you know, that we need to do. Uh, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna try to spawn the next kind of tree. And Kex told me the trick to it, which is to um, leave a space uh, between rows of pines and rows of birches and so we, that means we need to make space for birches to grow because we've been deleting them all so i'm going to do that here birch space pine space birch yeah so i'm going to delete the pines in these two rows and then i'm going to um pine space birch space pine space birch yes and then once those get filled in with birches then we're going to come back and delete those rows that i named as spaces and hopefully that will spawn the next tree type in the meantime we're going to be doing some massive massive changes to the uh, town here starting with uh this one you are empty let's pause for a moment let's um delete this and that and i want to actually reverse those so we're going to do a rail uh loading station here and we're going to do a rail on... Oops, I screwed that up. Oh, well. It just wasted a bunch of wood. That's okay. We're going to dr drive all this stuff back here. They're going to still be able to reach this from these two lumberjacks, but hopefully we'll get it pushed faster than they can haul it. And we'll be able to actually re remove this one. We also have a task to clear up a river... Uh, or to make a river fishery there. Uh, so we'll take care of that as part of this redesign too. Um, and doing this in the winter, I think, is actually kind of good. So you all can maybe go a little faster. Let's do this a little bit faster. Yep, one more cartload and we will be golden. Okay, you drop that off and then I'm gonna delete these again. And they're gonna, oops, well, that's okay. They're just gonna stay deleted for right now. We're gonna delete this whole thing actually um, because I'm gonna do something different with this. We're also gonna move this river fishery, which is what I was just talking about, um, over, over here to this end someplace. Uh, I guess I gotta remove that tree then too. Chop, chop. And let's do this. For now we'll connect it that way. I think I'm going to change the way it's connected, but for now we'll connect it that way. And then I need to have the aforementioned river fishery, and it needs to be down here someplace. Um, let's see, this one is linked to... Is that you? Yeah. You're linked to those two already just fine, so we can move this down um, this way. And I'm purposefully not telling you exactly what I'm doing because I think it's more fun that way. Let's put this here um, and then we'll let them build it. And then we can uh, build some of these river docks as well here. Maybe not the last two yet. Let's remove those last two. Uh, and then let this empty out by deleting uh, these. Which most of which are are full. Um, go ahead, that's good. And in fact, maybe I want a bit of a rail system here. Oh, I know what else we need to do. Speaking of rail systems, I need to delete these uh, from here. And we're getting wisdom back, but it's like one at a time, so I'm not that worried about it. Um, and then that means that I can delete these also here. I, mean, I think we're just going to wasting the fish. Although I could do, I could do a rail here like that. And then we could do an unloading station and a loading station. And we can move the fish that are in here down to there, thereby uh, clearing these out and things. There we go. Let's fast it up. All right, and then these two are fishing again, so we can delete them. I'm on that tree instead of the, where I wanted to be. Okay, there we go. So now this is empty. And so once this cart ends up emptying itself, then we can actually get rid of this as well. Uh, but I don't want to do anything with it yet because...
Please unload all those fish. Thank you. Here they come for them. I could probably put in a crossing um, here. Oh, that reset it. Yeah, right. That resets it. That's the only weird thing or problem, problematic thing is that uh, doing anything, <clears throat> editing the rail resets the cart. And if you're like me, then you don't want the cart being reset. Uh, we need to clear these trees out of the way, too. I'll do that here. Chop, chop. Meanwhile, I'm just kind of letting these do their thing. Uh, emptying themselves out from the uh, the wheat they have and the grain they have. And we'll eventually eat all that, and that'll be good. And we'll just need to get it uh, time, get the time done correctly. Uh, so I need to make some space here. I need to move this whole village this way several blocks. And so I think what this needs to do is we need to have this rail go this way. And then this way down probably gonna end up crossing here and onto this side and then we want to have um warehouse and uh this this is it here uh and these in this area someplace i want to make sure or do i and actually i don't care uh i want to just put this in somewhere where it can overlap with those if we want that's fine it's longer range that is um but we could come all the way down here too if i'm going to come all the way down here i should come all the way down that far though do I want to do that? Do I want to do that? Yeah, that'd be fine. Then we put in another um, granary uh, here, but I can't do it yet because I got to put a road in first. Put a road in here. And we can probably just connect it up like that for now. I have a little bit of wonkiness up here, which I'm gonna to try to straighten out somewhat, somehow, but I don't know how I'm gonna do it just yet, so we're gonna to have to figure this part out later. Um, but uh, this here goes there, and then this one can come just down here someplace, and even they can overlap with each other, that would be fine, but I also need to move this road. So this road will go here instead, and we can delete this one, like that. Because I want that as a straight line there, straight shot. Uh, let's see, let's do this then. Um, we can push this down a little bit then, I guess. Yeah. And then you can go here with this as well. That'll do. Uh, so we're going to have a crossing here then, for sure. And then we'll have rails here. And then I'm going to let them build this. Remember, we have all this wood here too that they can use to build it with. And I'm not going to deliver any grain to these yet. Uh, we can put in the station, I suppose, the unloading stations here and here. But I'm not going to actually deliver any grain to these yet because I want them to empty these two warehouses out completely first. And you can see that I did this in such a way that all four of those uh, mills are connected to all four of the, the uh, granaries so that they can all pull from all of them. That's going to help me flush these out faster. And then we're just going to have to figure out a way to... Oh, I didn't put that one down right, though. Uh, is to get the grain silo, uh, the grain unloaded from, the, from these. Actually, no, I don't, because these can just stay stay full. That'll be fine. Um, never mind. Never mind. Okay, halfway there. I might even do... No, this one. Something fancy with the loading here. Maybe even change this to be on this side, moving the sawmill around or something. Uh, let's figure out how, how I want how I want to do that because I haven't thought about that far yet. Uh, where are you at, Geode? Ah, there you are. As long as we don't starve these people out, we should be okay. So I can delete both of these now because they're empty because they have no grain reported. And then these two just need to burn themselves down and then they'll be good to go. These grain silos are full, so we should be okay for a long time on on, uh, on grain, um, on flour. So that's really good too, which means the bakeries will stay running for a while yet. Or I could just move this entirely. I mean, the coal's here, but we have coal over here, too. So we could potentially just put this over here, put the sawmills over here, and call it a day. Uh, I will figure that part out later. Much later. Probably later. Okay, so this is good. 
Um, you are still waiting to unload. Yeah, they still have some grain in there that needs to be unlo uh, unloaded as well. Why do you not... Oh, because you produce 12 per craft? Probably. All right. I think that we can start doing what I wanted to do here. So we're gonna build some more houses, um, but I wanna be careful with this because I do not want to um, get a bunch of people in just to have to evict them again, because then we'll have homelessness. So what I wanna do is like delete four and build four uh, this way. Actually, I should extend all these roads like this. And then do the same repeatedly. Oh, we can also get a geode. I'm going to take, try and collect as many of these geodes as I can because... Oh, there's another one. That's oh, up here. Oh, there's two of them in there. Oof. Uh, because of all the bonus... We're going to need all the bonuses we can get here. Um, let's see. So we're at... And I know they're going to complain about food and not having things. We're just going to have to suffer a little. Um, I'm sorry, but that's the way that it's going to have to be. Let's see. One, two, three, four. One, two... Four. Yeah, so to there. So all six of these can actually be deleted also. And we'll put some more in here. Okay, there we go. And you can see there's homelessness here. Uh, and you can see that homelessness causes negative uh, happiness. So we obviously don't want to have too much homelessness. I'm trying to compensate for that just a bit. Uh, let's do a road right here. We can put another one of these houses in there then. Sorry, everybody. There. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And see how, how unhappy they all got. Plus, the hunger is a problem here too. So the next thing we should do is fix the hunger problem. Uh, we need to have a wheat market, and that wheat market needs to be over here a bit further. So let's delete... Actually, let's figure out where that's going to go. Right there. Or there. Either one of those. Let's put it... Put it here. So delete another house. Here. Put in another wheat market. There. And then put in another house there. There you are. Sneaky. Okay, we'll satisfy that hunger. Oh, we need to do this again already. Uh, this is the wheat market. Yes, but I don't necessarily... Or do I? Want it there. Yeah, I do want it there. Okay, so let's do right here. Wheat market. Slow down just a little bit so we don't get too carried away here. There, please. And then a house right there. How about you guys? Are you done yet? No. Of course not. Why would they be? Oh, did I do that wrong? No, I didn't. Okay. Okay. And we might as well move... This one as well. Although that one doesn't have to be as far down. Let's do that one. So you're right there. You can go right there. Yeah, I did one space too close um, the last time around. You need wood. We need to bring a stockpile of wood in. We may have to do that sooner rather than later. Uh, let's actually do that. A different way here. Come on, chop, chop, everybody. Oh, we're out of grain here. Do I want to do something with that yet? No ish. Maybe yes. Okay, we're going to have to do it because of the hunger. Well, 
No, actually, we don't. Okay, never mind then. Uh, I want to put a rail in from here, this way. Down to somewhere over here. I just don't know exactly where. And I'm so I may end up moving this. Uh, and then we need a crossing here. Another rail there. Let's turn this so I can see what I'm doing. Did I did not chop that tree right there? Go ahead and do that. Another crossing here, and then a bridge here. As soon as they chop that tree, that. And then I'm going to put in a stockpile over here. Uh, that's got to be on the road, though. Um, let's just put it in here for right now, and then I'll just put in slight variation here of... Yes, I see you, uh, Geode. We're, gonna, we're coming in a minute. Unload here. And load here. That way we have wood down there at that end one. Um, and then let's... Find that geode. There it is. And let's delete. I think we're still okay. Actually, we are still okay. 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 Are you guys like sharing grain? Is that what's going on? No? I don't know. Okay. Uh, hunger is not a problem, so they're getting grain somehow. Uh, let's keep deleting and moving. Um, I think I do need to deal with this. Let's deal with this. Uh, let's remove all three of these. For now. And change this rail line. Uh, delete this, that, this one, that one. There. Because then I can finish this road. And I can put two more houses in right there. So let's do a uh, demolish of five more. And then an addition of one, two, three. Oh, oh no. Three, four, five minus this one. Plus pedantic that one. Uh, and I think I'm just going to have to remove these because they're just not really going through that flower that fast. Yeah. All right, we'll just delete them. It's fine. It's only a few pieces of grain and flour, so it's fine. And then we can have these more spaces for more houses. Um, hunger and homelessness, yes. Two problems plaguing our world. Uh, let's put in a woodcutter here. Move that one over, basically. Uh, uh, sorry, wood furnace. There. And then we'll do a, um, a well over here. That was three houses. One, two, three. That's here, yes. Well, here. And then this was tax man, right? Yes, the tax man. All right, let's demolish one, two, three, four. And put in the tax man right here. That'll increase the happiness temporarily until they all have to start paying taxes again. So we got a little bit of hunger. I can oh I can activate this uh, rail line now. Uh, bring in loading station. Let's do this like we did before. Again, I may end up changing this again, but for right now this is the way that it's going to have to be, and that'll bring the grain down to these two where we need it. And you're already done, but you're going to have to do the whole loop. That'll be fine. Okay. Uh, so, next story is delete these roads. Oh no, deleted a house. Uh, slow down. That house back in there. And then I need to delete a bunch more houses. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight houses. There's four of them. Two, three, four. Not enough wisdom. Oh, no. Not gaining enough wisdom enough fast enough. We don't have any wisdom thingies. 
I may have to increase... I can't increase the house population because I don't have... Yeah. I have a little bit of homelessness. That'll be fine. We'll get to 12.21 quadrillion shortly. Oh, there's one. Frenzies will help. Slightly. We do have two of the policies. We might be able to take advantage of that. Monument to the forest, which protects the forest at area trees in this area, grow by east and a kind combinations of adjacent trees. We get one more of those then. A watchtower again, uh, cost another one. Hearth and home is five, and first contact is one. 10% all wisdom gains, let's do that. And that gives us box of wisdom, which gives us bonuses to wisdom gains. Yep, boxes of wisdom, and then we can get whatever this is down here. Okay. Uh, we need to put in another house. Can we afford it yet? No, we cannot. This should have been something I did much earlier in the game, like from the beginning, but I didn't. So what are you going to do? Uh, that's the town hall. We'll still keep that near the center of this because of all the houses it touches. Uh, with the extra house happiness, of course. But I'm going to move it down here if I can remember how to move it properly. Um... Hopefully I don't screw myself up with this. Hopefully. Where are you at? There you are. But worst case, we lose that town hall, but I'd rather not. I just don't remember where we get it from. Is that it, maybe? That might be it. It's just an exclusive singular unit. I would like to be able to bring wood into this end of town, too, at some point, uh, strategically speaking. Um, hopefully that's possible. But it might require something different with the rails. I just don't know what that something is at this point. Um, or it might just require bringing the rail down. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I'm building uh, the ability to put three rails down the middle of town. And so, if that will work, then I could bring the wood in from this way and up one of those rails to drop off to these um, to these places. Hopefully. In theory. Eight quadrillion and counting. You're still homeless, you're still hungry. Yeah. Try to get you taken care of as soon as I can. You're standing here hungry as well. Is that because of where you live? Um, oh, because you're homeless, that's why, yeah. Uh, wisdom Geode. There you are. There's another Frenzy. That, should, that probably will get us to uh, the 12... 1.21 quadrillion. Probably. Getting into the, through the summer of this year now and into the fall in a moment. Very nearly, but not quite. Yeah, there's the fall. That frenzy, that is. Hmm. It's getting expensive. Once I rebuild this house, I could probably just let the game run a little bit automatically and. Um, build up some cash before we try to do another big move. That might be the best move for us. Once I get this one built, then we're at the same population as we were before. Wisdom Geo will help. There you are. Sneaky. Alright, we'll get there now. Come on. 
Oh, one of the population left. Oh. I didn't know that that would happen. Oh, actually, I did know that that would happen. Um, if they leave, they actually apparently ascend like, uh... And like they're being, I don't know, uh, lifted into the heavens. Alright, so we will chill and leave this here for a moment, because even if I delete a few houses, we still are going to need a good several quadrillion wisdom to do another batch, because we tore through what we had when we started this episode pretty quickly. So I think what I'm going to do is pause the recording for a little bit, let that wisdom build back up a bit, and then come back in and see what we can accomplish from this point. So I'll be right back. And welcome back. Winter is just upon us, and we are in a frenzy. I also got a wisdom storm, which gave me like 40,000 wisdom. It was pretty amazing. Uh, and I wanted to come back here and check on this to see what kind of birches we've gotten. Um, it doesn't look like very many, just a couple. It's hard to tell. Uh, maybe I can do a little bit of um, help here by removing some of the trees that are around this so that I can see what's actually in this. So we wanted pine, do, do, do. Yeah, so chop, Wait, harvest, harvest. If that is a birch, there. Birch, space, pine, space, birch. So remove some more of these pines and we'll hopefully grow some more birches there. And we'll be back to that. In the meantime, we'll come back up to this. So, one of the other things that I need to do here is add a few houses into a few other places. Uh, let's remove these two here, as well as let's slow it down. A couple of those there, and I want to put them in out here. Now I'm going to move the town hall and a bakery over here. Let's do the bakery first, since we can do that for sure. And then let's try to move the town hall as well. Demolish town hall. And can I get that back now? Okay, it's here, not there. Okay. We'll put that back in here then, and that will town hallify those. Uh, build me those houses. We get back up to 301. There we are. And then I want to move these four houses as well here, as well as that bakery, uh, since this is now uh, done. So let's harvest that geode. There it is. 30x wisdom gains. Nice. All right, so let's delete this and those four. And then we'll build four more houses. One, two, and actually these two here. Three, four. And then we're going to have a road right here. And then this space, rail space, rail space, rail. i got to move these guys over by one more, but that won't be a problem. Uh, we'll have three rails coming down the middle here, uh, which we talked about during the last episode, I think. Build, please. Build, build, build. Build, build, build. There we are. And our happiness is okay. Uh, and then we keep moving. Um, we need to still fill this in and still empty these out. They're nearly there. That's good, question mark. Um, we got to have a spot for that, though. Forgot about that. we got to have a spot for the grain mill. Um, nope, nope, nope. That's going to have to be still in this line, which is kind of a bummer. But it is what it is. I guess I could just put it here. I think I'd rather put it over here someplace. So let's delete uh, one of these houses, say this one. And rebuild it, say right there. And then build a grain mill right there. And then the other one I'm going to put in before I forget about it. I'm going to put over here. Like that. And then that way these two will empty out, which that one already, one of them already has. Goodbye. And we can use that space for more housing. Okay, so we do have one space for a fish market right here. So we need to remove that house. Put it in over here. Put in the fish market. Like that. And then that is unfortunately not going to be... Oh, yeah, it will be connected to uh, to this still, I think. Because it's got a huge, huge, huge range on it. And it'll actually also be maybe connected down to this one? No. Okay, never mind. We can 
I don't want to remove that just yet. Come on. Thank you. Alright. Let's, let's just go through the motion of removing the four houses and... Building... Building four more. One, two, three, four. We've got nine left. And our wisdom is low again. Um, I don't necessarily want to remove these just yet until we remove what's here. Same with this stuff, yeah. I want to wait until I can move them around before we actually remove those houses. Or those uh, stores, that is. So that's a, that's a loop. And what, well, the reason I'm doing this is because there's a couple more things that we're going to want to fit into this neighborhood. And I want to put those in this spot. So you've made basically almost the same number of houses in the neighborhoods. Just a, a little bit less as we need it for, um, for these stores and, and public service buildings and things. Because uh, we can always put in more tax collectors too, I think. I think I read that on the uh, on the on the Discord. Um, you can actually have more than one tax collector in every house, which is kind of disturbing, um, but also kind of amusing. So we could do that too. You got to be careful with the happiness, but you get more taxes. Maybe we should just do that. Let's remove this one. Let's put in that house down here. And then we'll put in another tax collector. Right there. Build, build, build. Oop. Geode. Another geode. Spark of inspiration. There's the other one over there. Spark of inspiration. So now we're collecting taxes from two tax collectors next to each other. Uh, which one of them has one more house because we haven't finished the neighborhood yet, but um, that means we're going to gain even more taxes than we were before, which is a good thing, in this case, at least. Uh, let's remove... Continue removing this intermediary road because we don't actually need it anymore, and that'll help me with space to put in more houses. Uh, but we're also a little short on cash again, so we're not going to be able to do four more houses until we have a bit more cash. Let's speed up the game. I'm hoping we get some more geodes and can do this a little bit faster. Um, what might be the most prudent would be for me to do some of this off camera and then come back and show you the next segment of this rather than continuing to do a little bit here, a little bit there. Although we could also plan out some of these rails, too. Because uh, we know where they're going to go. They're going to go here. With crossings, of course. Uh, we can remove these trees here, too. Because they're in the way. There. Excuse me. There. And then we can do another one right here. And then the last one's going to go where that road is. So we actually have a little bit of work we can do for that, too. Maybe we should just do that. There we go. Um, for that, I want to actually get rid of or change around some of this stuff. Let's uh, chop these trees in this area. Um, I want to move these sawmills a little bit. So let's delete those. Oops. What did I just delete? A house. I deleted a house. Was it a regular house or was it a village house? Um, it only says two homeless citizens. I deleted something. I think it was a village house, but I'm not positive. Can't quite afford that yet. Uh, and then what I want to do is try to salvage as much of this wood as possible by putting him over here.
Yeah, I'm gonna not be able to salvage a large part of it. Um, where are you at? Hello, Geode. There you are. Frenzy, good. And then let's delete this and that, and then do a unloader and a loader and a delete on this one. Hmm? Weird. Maybe because I had deleted... Okay, well, I just lost some more lumber, but that's okay, or some more logs. Holy crap, these trees are crapping up like crazy. Okay, so we're kind of we're kind of stuck now. Let's delete that, delete this and that, and then put in the um, the re laying of this like that, and then we're back to normal. Let's take a look at this again because all these regrew already, and I should have done this more often before, and I didn't. Uh, this one and this one, that's a birch. This one and this one, that's a birch. This one. Um, space, pine, space, birch. This one, this one, this one, and that one. Let's see if we can get some more birches to grow. And I have enough for one more of these houses, so I'm just going to put one of these in. Rather than fretting about it too much. Now uh, let's bulldoze this. And then clear these stupid trees again. <laughs> and I need to move this road over here. And then we can bulldoze this road here. I can put in those sawmills again. It's got to be in a different spot, which maybe I should actually wait and do this. And then maybe move those around. Um, I hadn't thought about that part. Where's the fish market at? Here? Oh, we've got plenty of room. Okay, good. Uh, let's do... Well... Chop some of those. Put in sawmill. Yeah, that'll be fine. Put one there. We'll put one right there. I think I'm just gonna remove these and just suck it up. Uh, let's do a river fishery right there and an ocean fishery right there and then fix this rail like this to get that back to work. Uh, this goes here and then we can do an unloading station right there once we have the uh, stuff, except that I don't want you going up there. Uh, demolish that. Loading up a wagon full. Unloading here. Loading there. And then I can put in another rail line right here. Crossing. And we'll just have to align to this when we are ready to do this project. Okay. Spring. Spring has sprung. And what are you? An abandoned house. Interesting. Uh, we got a geode someplace. There you are. Okay. Uh, let's do some bulldozing of some housing. Maybe I can delete that one. We can put it in. Oh, don't need to put it in. Okay. I have no idea what I deleted up here then. Oh, I know what I deleted. The Mad Hatter. That's what I deleted. Uh, the Milliner. That's what I deleted. That's what was there. Alright, put that back. Oopsie. Was that where it was? Maybe. Maybe. If not, oh well. Uh, these need to move too, though. This bakery and this, this fish market, they need to be over here as well. That's a little bit more of a problem that I didn't think about. Crap. Uh, 
those, I don't know what I can do with those. They can just go here, right here where these two houses are. But we're going to need more money for that, so let's, um... Oh, good, we got an apple tree. Uh, let's not, um, then. There's an apple tree right there. We can harvest that, because we need to for this 50 wisdom. And then plant an apple tree, which we can now do. And that's what we were looking for, was how do we harvest apple trees? How do we, how do we find, make apple trees? And that's how you do it. Uh, and then we have a fruit market that we can we can distribute fruit out to these places, which is where and why I want the extra space, because I knew the fruit market was coming. We need to um, probably give some more room for the apple trees, but we also have a couple more trees that we can pick up here along the way. I'm guessing the next one needs to have a birch and an apple next to each other, and then a space, just like this needed pine and a birch with some space in between them. So maybe we do... Um, just some creativity here. Let's remove... Yeah, let's remove these... Nope, that's not it. These birches that are over here on this side. Let's remove this one. And... Let's remove... I could plant birches. Why was I waiting for them to grow? I don't know. Losing my mind, I guess. Let's do this. Do this. Plant some birches. Oh, those are quadrillions. That's why I was waiting for them to grow. Let's do that and hope that we get the next tree to grow right in there. But also that might give us the ability to spawn some uh, more apple trees instead of having to grow them. So let's see what happens with those. Look at all these trees right here. It's crazy. Okay, so uh, yes, let's build or rather. I'm going to wait on the fruit, the fruit market though for a moment. Let's move this uh, fish market and this bakery right into here. Um, I could potentially put one there. No, I can't. They have to go right here. Um, but we need the money to build two more houses, which we may or may not have. Let's see if we can do it. We may or may not have it. Delete these two. Build two more here. And then put in the bakery and the fish market uh, again right here. And the bakery is this one. And then we can delete those two. We had plenty of money. There we go. Okay. Uh, wisdom geode. There you are. Sneaky. Need to remove those two houses to move these two things down. I have? I do have. Okay. Let's do a wood furnace here and a well there. And then we can delete... Well, we can't delete those yet, but we can move things around a bit more. I'm amused by the three carts just zipping back and forth there. Okay, so you're going to start failing out, which is fine. Uh, bread is the not the most significant thing we need, so that's in, in these houses, so that's okay. Um, we're going to need to move some more of these houses, which means we need more money, which means that any more apple trees by chance? We did get another tree type though, an acacia tree. Let's harvest that right there. Pine's best friend. Okay. I don't know what that means. I can maybe make an educated guess, but I don't know what it means. Let's put one of those in right here. And then maybe delete, nope, this one. Harvest that. Let's see what that does. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is actually end this episode here rather than um, come back. 
with more because we've done a bit more than I expected. But I think we'll end this episode here and we'll come back in the next one. I'll finish moving all these houses so that we have this shape down here uh, full of however many houses we need to fill all these people in. And then we can work on this part of town as well as the rail lines in the middle in the next episode to get things going together. We have a bulbous tree that we can harvest too. Which is the last one. Improves nearby houses. Oh, so we can build those outside of our little nursery here. And then um, uh, use those uh, for improving the houses. So we'll want to put those in those extra spaces as well. So we'll see how that pans out in the next episode. And possibly beyond. And we'll go from there. So thank you all for joining me. And I will see you all next time. Bye for now.